Let's subscribe to the Archfiend. Hmm. 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 Around 30 minutes to an hour ago, I posted this comment, and then I refreshed. I waited like about, yeah, 17 minutes after that, and I refreshed, and it was still there. And I'm about to refresh it now because I'm not sure. He's probably deleted it by now. But let's take a look. Let's hit that nice little refresh button. You can see my comments gone. And the arch from 27 minutes ago, I will make a video about Osama being dead later tonight. That is all. Um, yeah, but where's my comment? It, it was right there. It's supposed to be right there. Wow. I didn't even do anything to you, Arch, and you blocked me? I mean, heck, I even... I said, what's up, Arch? Look. And you blocked me. All because I was... All because UTF was on my ass. My god, what did I do to you to get blocked? Undertaker fag motherfucker. Tattletail asshole. Going around telling, hey, block this one. All I said is, what's up, Arch? I was trying to be friendly. It, I, I mean, I hate UTF, but does that mean I have to be blocked from you too just because I don't like UTF? Wow. Way to stick up for your boyfriend. The guy is the guy's a genius, though. He's clever. You know how he says that? You don't see me doing these ads on my YouTube videos. I, uh, you know, you know why? Okay. The thing is, his Archfiend website, ads on those things pay more than his YouTube videos. <laughs> and when he posts the video, especially when he posted about the earthquake video with no ads, he has the awesome Archfiend.com. He has it right down there on the very top of the link where of uh, the description where people can click on it and pay him. And this is actually what I'm going to say. This is going to blow your guys' mind, but... Putting an ad on, say, an earthquake video is the exact same thing as not putting an ad on the same video. And I'm going to explain why. Because when you draw traffic to your website and your videos, which pop up on the related and also on your channel, what happens is you actually get paid regardless because even though there's no ad on that video, they're going to go to your channel and they're going to click other ad placed video, uh, you know, videos with ads on them. And that's still yeah. going to pay you. So, yeah. the only thing that I can think of is it's better not to make a video, period. Hello everyone, it's the Archfiend back with another video for you guys this evening. Within one hour of posting my video last night, uh, the Irate Gamer had banned me from his YouTube page. I mean, I have to give it to him, that's, that's, that's pretty damn efficient, I mean... He probably has little spies out there that tipped him off that let him know someone out there wasn't in 100% com compliance with him. I mean, God forbid I don't agree with everything he does to a T, but such is life. Kind of disappointing that he had to go that route, but what can I say? It's a free world. He can do what he wants to do. I just don't have to respect him, nor do I respect him, nor do the majority of people out there that follow and watch his videos respect him. I don't know, frankly, I think he should call the Guinness Book of World Records because he's probably broke the record for the amount of sand one can have in their vagina. Get you up to speed of the type of person we're dealing with here because um, he's obviously someone that is not open to a fair criticism and doesn't want to hear things out and wants to create a world of total 100% compliance. Anyways, Keep making those great videos. I'm sure you'll have a lot of fans that enjoy your stuff. Even though I'm not I'm no longer subscribed to your page since I can't subscribe to your page since you banned me, I'll check your videos out anyway. Because like I said, 
you can live in the world that James created. I just wish you would do a little bit more to gain a little bit more respect. 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 